Mr. Yorkie Lover Fitness dot com. My friends, um, I uh, I get a well, I get the emails. I try to read the emails. I try to read the comments on the videos. It wasn't for Jason. He reads all the comments and he tells me what they want. And I try to read some of the comments. And I find, you know, I just not enough time because I'm domesticated, my friends. I take care of myself. It takes hours. I'll talk about that later. Uh, now, what we're talking about now is the foundation of exercising, the building of exercising, and the foundation. Now, you see, I get so many requests. I said, geez, you know, it makes me feel, <laughs> I, I, I'm, I'm getting nuts as I get older because I, I get so much feeling for you guys, as I said before, and your, and your heart for knowledge. And they all say, how do you work out what you do? My dear friends, what I do is not important. It's the foundation of your knowledge, how you can apply it to your routines. Do not hamper yourself checking out all these people's routines. They're personalized. Now, let me tell you, my friends. Do you know something? My workout routine will make you say, huh? In my entire life, I never did more than two, maybe maximum of three exercises of a body part. Because there was no need to. It really wasn't. I mean, I did the basics. I found the alternate dumbbell curl and the scoop curl got in all the heads of my bicep. And there was no need to do all these other exercises. Five and six exercises, the same body part, doing the same thing. Now, remember, my friends, the bicep curls the arm up. This, that's what the function of the bicep. Now, you can do it on the, on the, but that's the function of the bicep. And so I never, we're in the gym, we never did more than two to three exercises. Now, we would change around. You know, I mean, we would do the, the code, I tell you that, that was really, we would do that periodically. We would take a solid barbell, because that's all they had, an adjustable, that's all they had, barbell dumbbells. You know, we're going back, but that doesn't mean that I'm in the present now, and I know all this stuff. And we would stand in front of each other with one barbell. I would do 10 reps, pass it to him, he'll do 10. You know, without any rest, until you couldn't move. Somebody come over to you, put a gun to your head, and say, do one more curl. You couldn't do it. We did that periodically to shock the muscle. But basically, we did two exercises of body part. Now, I, if you guys see my chest, you see how it was developed. You know the two exercises I did? Bench, wide grip bench presses and dips on a dipping bar for the lower pecs. That was the main exercise. Now you could do laterals, sometimes you throw the little laterals, but that was the basics of the building of the body. The curls, two exercises for the, for the, tri, the bicep, and, the, and, the, and the, for the bicep. The tricep, we used to do uh, the tricep curl, but you do, the, you do it like this, the way, like the tricep curl. We didn't have any machines. What I'm telling you is the evolution, see, but the evolution never changed the basics. Guys are scrambling around with some magic motion and exercise. You know, the body functions never changed. It's never changed. We have different ways of attacking it, but it's never changed. And if you, it's, it's all according also, my friends. What you want out of this? See, what do you want? If you want to look like the hardcore guys, forget it because you're not going to get that. These guys, their life, I mean, they're totally engrossed and getting bigger and, 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 and freaky. They told her, and 99% of you guys are not interested in it. If you're interested in it, you waste your time, and you're not going to devote yourself to that kind of training and diet. I, I see a number of them, when I was running my stores, 
a number of guys that come in and see the pictures of the, you know, all the modern bodybuilders on the wall, and they say, oh, I don't want to look like that. I said, don't worry about it, my friend. That's the least of your worries. Because what you have to do to get like that, you're not going to do. So don't let, don't think you go into bed and wake up in the morning and look like one of these guys. You got to break your ass. You got to get, get this restricted diets. I mean, it's a, it's a mission for these guys. And I, 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 you know, I have mixed emotions only because I, 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 the beauty is gone. But that's beside the point. The point is what I want you to know. The foundation of your exercise. I want you to build a foundation. Don't jump into this. Because when you jump into this intense workout, following guys' routines that have been training for years, it takes the excitement away. It wears you out. And you have too high an expectation, my friends. Your body needs time to adjust, time to recover, time to recognize what you're doing. It takes time. You cannot rush it with somebody else's routine or some magic pill. I make my bicep the other day on one of the, the you know, I look at my body every now and then because I don't, I mean, I, I get my thing. And I'm like surprised at how well the muscle has been maintained. Not, I mean, you know, present looking because of muscle memory. I've been training since I was 10 years old. The body don't forget. It's like I always tell you guys, complain, but don't explain. So what I want you to do, and you don't have to be a beginner. You don't need but two exercises of body part. That's all. And you, Bill, I mean, if you go to my website, LeroyCobra.com, and I will, and you will see bodybuilders of my era. And you see the bodies. Very good. I mean, we didn't have all the machines you guys got now, so what did we build our legs with? Squats. Just squats. And if you go down parallel, it'll get the hamstring. It won't be as concentrated as the uh, leg uh, a curl machine. But it's all, if you want to sculpture every little muscle, if you want to enter a contest, fine. But if you want to train, for the rest of your life, for your health and looking good and making people say, oh, boy, you're 50, you're 60. And I'm not talking about just the older now, remember. You young fellas, even worse, the older guys, just from, they can't do it anyhow. But you young fellas, I know how you, how you see the point with me, but you guys don't, that you don't have anybody around that can compare to me is because I grew up with, the, the the drive and, and, and anxiety and the and the willing to kill myself to get a body. I grew up with that. I know what you young fellas are going through because that's the mentality of the young. I'm not a guy 40 years old decide to start teaching you stuff and have no concept of what you felt and what you were going through and how you developed because it's a difference. I, it's like yesterday, I remember how I train and how I was so, you know, so enthused. I wanted, what can you do? What, what can I do to get bigger? And everything's bigger, bigger, bigger. But we had the time to develop and learn. And I'll tell you something, even if you, when you start, don't get involved with three and four exercises of body part, please. First of all, to do that, you need the large muscle mass to do that. You got to have the muscle mass for that for that kind of a strenuous workout to be of any benefit. So two exercises of body part until you build the fat. And I'll tell you something. You'll find that you and you can devote your entire drive and energy to those two exercises. That's all you need. Two for the chest, two for the uh, for the biceps, two for the triceps. You can do a couple for the legs, because now you can do things other if you go to the gym. If you don't have a gym, all you need is squats. There's no exercise in the world that compared to the parallel squat. That means don't go below parallel for the legs. But of course, you got all these machines now and everybody, you know, but there's nothing wrong with them. But this is what, that's why I'm telling you the foundation, my friends. I get it so much, what is your routine? 
What's the And you know what? Once you get built, you start adjusting your routine based on what you want and how far you want to get into this. But if you start with a basic, you'll find it's all you ever will need. And that's you're going to compete and only in a in minute amount of guys compete. And then when you compete, you go on to another strata. To be continued, my friends, I'm here to continue our conversation. And this is just the beginning of this foundation on foundation. I'll be talking all day because, you know, they slapped me with the windbag thing. But I, you're my friends because I can relate. I can relate to the 12-year-old or 15-year-old all the way up to to the age I am now, because I went through all that. So I'll tell you to be continued.